brilliant stuff. If you put my microphone to my tummy, you'd hear it rumbling right now. Alexis <laughs> is here with the forecast. Can I wear my shorts this weekend? Uh, I don't think so, no. Oh. Well, it's going to be breezy, so okay. it's not going to be warm, warm, but it's, it's going to get very mild next week, though. Gemma White took this lovely picture this morning in Wimborne. Yes, Victoria Tim sent us this shot of a cat in the sunshine in Brill. Oh, look, in Buckinghamshire. Oh. And Fergus photographed the needles in the sunshine today. So we had beautiful blue skies from the word go this morning once the mist and fog finally lifted. And it was the warmest day of the year so far in Wigan Holt in West Sussex, 17.5 celsius that's the warmest day in england and also the uk lovely scenes i feel like i could walk down this beach right now but it's obviously dark out there but swanage in dorset photographed by robin redbreast one of our weather watchers so through the weekend saturdays the quite breezy during the course of saturday a fairly moderate to fresh breeze from the east more cloud around on sunday but there will be some sunshine as well clear skies will develop overnight tonight we've seen that breeze starting to increase from the east and temperatures for northern than most areas could fall to around two degrees so we may see a touch of frost for northern parts elsewhere it'll be frost free but away from that breeze in sheltered spots we could have some mist and fog patches so tomorrow there will be blue skies overhead some patchy cloud from time to time a fresh to moderate easterly wind which will take the edge of temperatures slightly and it will be slightly stronger for exposed coastal stretches with temperatures a little bit lower than today up to around 14 degrees but still high for the time of year. As we look ahead to the inshore waters that's the coastal forecast from Selseyville to Lyme Regis. The winds are east 5 or 6 decreasing 4 or 5 later and the visibility is good. Now, tomorrow night, the skies stay clear once again. The winds fall slightly lighter, so we could see more widely a frost developing first thing on Sunday morning. So it will be a chilly start to Sunday with a lower freezing or just above. Sunday, there will be plenty of sunshine in the morning. As the day progresses, we start to see weather fronts from the east and west start to move in, bringing with it a lot more cloud. And we could, down to western parts of Dorset, see the odd spot of rain, but most places will stay dry during during the daytime with that increasing cloud. So Monday may start on a fairly cloudy note, but it will brighten up through the afternoon with large areas of sunshine. Look at this as we head Tuesday, Wednesday up to around 18, maybe 19 degrees come Wednesday. Very mild for the time of year. And the forecast for the rest of this month looks pretty good. Ed. Nice, Alexis, thank you very much indeed. Now, we've already been tempted by those chocolate mm. brownies on the Isle of Wight, haven't we? But the Red Nose Gang aren't the only ones raising money today. That's right, from individual people to schools, care homes and local businesses, it's been a busy day. It certainly has. Let's take a look at what you've been up to.